Hi guys, Aka here. Well, Ebony has done it again. Some genius at the Ebony Development Group decided it was a good idea to ruin rank and prestige. Honestly, I don't like making negative videos and I've tried my best to refrain from doing that, but this one just kind of ticked me the wrong way. In case you don't know what I'm talking about, today we were greeted by an announcement from Ebony that talks about new items in the Alliance shop. Sounds all well and good, right? The thing is, what Ebony is offering here is an Alliance monthly card. It's like a monthly subscription. As you can see here, you purchase the monthly card and then you get Alliance points, which you can use to buy tributes for offering. When you purchase the card, you get 10 million Alliance points. Yeah, 10 million. That is 1,000 tributes right there. You also get 2 million Alliance points every day for the month. So if we're looking at 30 days in a month, that's 60 million Alliance points every month. That's 6,000 tributes. That is crazy. There is absolutely no way that you can match that in the game. Let's go out and take a look at the thing. It's right here. There it is. Alliance monthly card. You get it. 10 million points, 2 million every day. You get some gems, you get some VIP, no one cares about that. And it's about $20 in price. For me, this is just insane. Yeah, there is a good side to this in the sense that it will help you get along with moving your Monarch XP. So you'll be able to get to the, mon to the higher Monarch XP ranks quicker. If you are trying to hold on to your rank, you have to be buying this every month. There is no way, there is absolutely no way in the game for you to compete with this amount of Alliance points and tributes in any other fashion, even if you are buying packs on a regular. And for me, that is crazy. That just completely ruins the rank and prestige system as if it wasn't bad enough already. And unfortunately, this gets even more stupid on so many other levels. First off, this is what you get when you buy the Alliance card. In addition, if we come to the Alliance shop, you now have a special section for Alliance card holders, in quotes, trying to make it like some kind of exclusive membership shit. As you can see here, you have some items that you can purchase. If you look at this, you can purchase five tributes for 20,000 points. And that is exclusive to the Alliance card holders. If we come down, we can see that purchasing a tribute will cost you normally 10,000. If you're purchasing five, that's 50,000. So not only do you get that ridiculous amount of Alliance points, but you're also getting a discount on tributes at less than half of the cost. Again, if you're trying to boost your Monarch XP, this might look like a great deal. But for rank and prestige, that system is dead. It's, it's crazy. I really don't understand why they came up with this. If they wanted to give us a way to get more Monarch XP, there are so many other ways they could have done it. They could have increased the drops in Hydras, so you get more XP from that. They could have increased the amount of XP you get per offering in the Shrine. This is just crazy. In my case, for example, I have been saving up my Alliance points for a very long time. You can see I have over 7 million. And anytime I want to do offering, I know that I can just take that, dump it in, and I'll be good, even if I drop in rank. But this just completely changes the whole thing. Like I said, there is no other way in the game for you to get this amount of points. Even winning the Monarch competition will not give you anywhere near close to the amount of alliance points and tributes that you will get from this. Honestly, Ebony, if you're listening, you need to fix this. Like, seriously, you I don't know why you came up with this. No one asked for it. No one wanted it. The things that you think you're trying to achieve with this could have been achieved in so many other better ways. There's so many other things in the game 
that need to be improved. This is just bullshit. I'm actually going to buy the card now. So you see they aren't joking with this. There. Done. I have to claim it, okay? I've claimed my 2 million alliance points for today. If we come to the alliance shop. There. You can see it. 19 million. Where have you ever seen this amount of alliance points? I mean, this is just crazy. I'm going to buy the tributes now. Done. I don't know about you guys, but for me, this thing needs to go. I don't even care about the money right now. Ebony, if you're watching, you can refund me my money. You can give me the money back in gems. I don't mind. Give it to me in other items. That's fine. But this thing has completely ruined one of the core systems in the game and it needs to go. This is even doubly annoying because today as well, Ebony also released an announcement saying that SVS Wings is now top 10, which is great. This is an objectively good thing that a lot of people have been asking for. But then you ruin it by making this kind of addition that completely destroys one core part of the game. I don't know what you guys think. Do you think this is a good idea? Are you as pissed off about it as I am? If you are, leave a comment down below. Let's know. And if you are as annoyed about this as I am, share this video. Let people see it. Let's get the word out. If you want, get the link of this video. Send it to Ebony customer service. Tell them that this shit needs to go. Because this is... Uh. Anyway, that's it for me, guys. Aka signing out.